As California continues to descend into utter chaos, it has become one of the top states that people are moving out of, and many of those abandoning the state are members of the Hollywood elite. Superman, actor Dean Cain is now one of the many entertainers who have fled California, and Cain left no doubt as to why. In an interview with Fox News, Cain blamed the state's Democratic governor, Gavin Newsom and the Democrat-led legislature for totally destroying the state with their chaotic and un-American policies. The actor lamented the mess that Newsom and the Democrats have made of his once beautiful home state and admitted he moved to Las Vegas, Nevada. My home in Malibu was going to be my forever home. That was where I was going to die, and everything was going to be just fine. You can't beat the weather. And I had a lovely house with the most incredible views, Kane said. But he then added, governments can ruin an area. And that's what's going on in California. What is happening under Gavin Newsom and the Democratic leadership in the House, in Congress, people I did not vote for. People did in California vote for it. I didn't. But it's the most ridiculous large government. Incredible taxation. Horrible regulations for business. Very anti-business. The personal income tax is 13. The highest levels, 13, 13.2, whatever it happens to be, he explained. The taxes are extreme, he said. Adding, you're getting hit with the highest gas tax in the nation, sales tax, food tax, energy tax, natural gas tax. It's as though they're trying to tax people out of there. But it isn't just taxation Kane is horrified with. The policies are just terrible. The fiscal policies, the soft on crime policies, the homelessness policies. The things that our leaders in California have been doing have driven out anybody who can really afford to get out. People are flocking out of there in droves. Kane is right, too. California has been one of the top states for people moving out for nearly a decade now, and in 2021, it actually lost population for the first time ever. The God's Not Dead star is also right that the state is anti-business. As far back as 2016, for example, the state lost 1,800 business that moved out of state, and that pace has continued since then. Outside of politics, Kane was also concerned with the education in the state. I didn't like the things they were teaching in the public school, he said. It's pernicious, you know, just bit by bit by bit. It gets there, and it just makes you feel like you're working for Big Brother or that you can't do anything. So, I had to get out of California, he continued, labeling his former home the land of ridiculousness. Kane noted that he knows a lot of people who are financially stuck in California. I know so many people who want to get out of California who just cannot do it, he said. I left. I moved into Las Vegas. I live in Nevada now. I have ten times as nice a house. I'm not kidding. Ten times as nice a house as I had in Malibu, and it cost less than our place in Malibu, he said in amazement. Kane is only one of many actors who left California behind. He joined actors, including The Waterboy, cast member Rob Schneider. Dawson's Creek, star James Van Der Beek, Happy Days, star Scott Bio, and action movie star Mark Wahlberg. The state of California is being run into the ground by the Democrats there. And people are responding by leaving their homes and moving elsewhere. Silicon Valley and the big tech tyrants have done everything they can to put the Western Journal out of business. Our faithful subscribers have kept us going. If you've never chosen to subscribe, let me be honest, we need your help today. I also want to send you an autographed copy of Counterpunch, which will give you a plan to fight back for our beloved country. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel JackCN24. Thank you for watching.